guys, it's Rush, and today's video is going to be about my pet peeves. I hope you guys do enjoy this video, so stay tuned if you want to watch this. Or you can click on the little X, but the little X won't like you right after. So, watch this video. Everyone has pet peeves, it's just that some get mad easier than others. So, let's get straight to the video. So this video was requested by Ash Quality on Instagram, so you guys should check out her Instagram because she's awesome. So number one of my pet peeves is when you go shopping for clothes and you realize that there's this adorable and really, really cute shirt that you want to buy, but then when you go and try on the shirt, you realize it's too big for you. So then you look for the next size, but guess what? The next size doesn't fit you, so what do you do? Shop for something else? No! You want that shirt! That is really like, annoying. This actually leads me to number two. When you're looking at a shirt that's really nice, but you can't find the price tag. And you really want that shirt, but there's like so many people in line. You can't ask anyone because everyone's busy. And then you decide, oh well, I'm not going to look at the price. I'm just going to get the shirt. Like, no. Number three. Something that annoys me also is when you go shopping with your mom or just go grocery shopping, carts all have issues. I mean, when a cart wheel is broken, you don't just put it back in there. You don't like put it back in there. You just like remove the cart, like decapitate the cart or something. They'll just put it back in there so another person could get it. That just like literally kills me. I mean, when it's empty and it's easier to push, so you don't really realize that the cart has technical difficulties on it. Technical difficulties. I mean, you only realize it when you're starting to have more and more food coming in. Because food is like the bomb. So, when you have like so much food coming in, then you realize this cart is not moving. You're like in the middle of the shop and you're like, this is not moving. Mom, the cart's not moving anymore. Peace. Pocket. On your face, loser, loser, twist, twist. What is this in my wrist, wrist? Ha, oh boy, don't take like this, cause stop it. Number four is when you clearly leave your earphones untangled on the table, and then when you come back from eating, suddenly your earphones are just all tangled up and you don't understand why. <laughs> That's actually just funny and like mind blowing how crazy. It is. Or when you just simply put it in your pocket and your earphone just like slips out with like two bazillion tangles around it. Minutes or five minutes to untangle my earphones and I'm just like, please help me. Number five, and this is going to be the last one for this video, is when you have a friend who tells you they have something important to tell you and then suddenly bails on you and tells you, oh, forget about it. Oh my gosh, Roger, there's something so amazing that just happened. I have to tell you everything about it. Like, oh my gosh, what happened? Oh, you know what? It's nothing. Uh, I changed my mind. Why are you doing this to me? Oh my gosh. Ah! So guys, I hope you guys... Why do I say guys so much? So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't be offended if I mention something that you do or that you notice. And I'm sure you could relate to at least one of these pet peeves. I'll see you on my next video. Please subscribe, like, comment, share, do whatever you want with this video. Click on the X right now if you want to. Or you could watch my other videos on my channel, which would be amazing. So, this is it for now. See you in 10 more weeks. I'm just kidding. Make sure to check out my links below. And why am I talking so slow? I'm such a weird person. Battery is like flashing red right now, like I could see it. That person and see what I did. I made my brother's lunchbox appear. Never mind. Focus, focus. To the right, to the left. And you jiggle, and you jiggle. And you jiggle till you wiggle till you higgle and you mingle. Are you single like a Pringle or taking bacon? I'd rather be taking bacon if I get to eat some bacon. Bacon, some bacon. Mm -hmm. You know what the question of are you single Pringle or taking bacon is ass? I feel like I should answer taking bacon because bacon is good. Bacon is yummy. My gosh, my hair looks orange. Oh, so see you soon. Brap, up, and this is in. This is out.